right, everybody, welcome back to the Sea Island Golf Performance Center. We're back here in our beautiful short game area. We're going to be talking about uh, putting and specifically speed control inside of 15 feet. It's one of the most important factors to putting. So I've got one of our tour speed drills set up right now. This is one of the things that a lot of our tour guys uh, use kind of week in and week out. It's very difficult, um, but this is it's a simple setup. So firstly, I'd want you to have find it like a, an old hole. So think about where a cup used to be. If you can't do that, you can use a coaster or a ghost hole just like this, uh, but I don't want you to use a real hole. And then behind it, one feet, two feet, and three feet, I've, I've got three T's. Um, a better way to do it would be to have like chalk pen dots or uh, ball markers that fit flush into the ground just because when the balls are rolling through the old hole, we don't want the T's deflecting them. And then you'll have uh, ball piles set up at five, 15, or 5, 10, and 15 feet. And then from there, how you play the game is, is pretty simple. So you're going to roll your first putt with your intention of trying to get the ball to stop somewhere between the ghost hole or old hole and that first tee. And if you're not successful, you start over. So I wasn't successful after my first attempt and I would take another attempt, start again. That was a little bit better. And then the second thing I would do is roll the next ball from here and try to get it to stop between the first uh, and the second marker. And then from the the third ball, I'm trying to get it to stop between the second and the third marker. If I've successfully completed that, I'll move on to the 10-foot putt. Once I've successfully completed that, I'll move on to the 15-foot putt. If I've hit all nine balls in a row successfully to finish it up, I would hit one ball from the first pile, trying to get it to stop between the old hole and the first marker. I'd go to the second pile, hit one ball, try to get it to stop between the old hole and the second marker. And third and finally, last ball pile, try to get that ball to stop between the old hole and the third marker. If you can dial in your speed and your touch inside of 15 feet, that's really gonna help you sink more putts. And uh, we'll see you soon.